Hello, and welcome back to Super Mid-Tier. We're back once again in Hades 2, and today we're going to be doing another run with the torches. We're using the Aspect of Eos. Went pretty well last time I used it. Um, and we're going to be taking on Cerberus. Seeing, or that's the target we got for the bounty, I should say. Now, quick refresher on these torches. Uh, so what it does is it changes the Omega Special to unleash this little cloud that does just big bursts of damage. And also, if you use your special, it launches your special at the same time. Last time I did a pretty uh, successful okay. run uh, using Apollo on the attack. Went pretty well, but this time I'm going to go with Hera. Uh, should be pretty good just doing lots of, uh, lots of the hitch condition. Being able to just get lots of damage in on everyone all at the same time. We're doing a surface run in part because I really want to get the material I need to unlock the uh, aspect of Nyx, which I need some materials from uh, the Chaos Realm. So, let's go ahead and do this. You've encountered mighty Heracles, big, thick-headed fellow. You're not to aid him in his labors. Do you understand? He's in the middle of what we Olympians like to call a journey of self-discovery. Okay, so this is the middle of Heracles' labors? I kind of thought, like, he was maybe... It was, like, after he had essentially died and become, like, the god of strength or something. Oh, well. Okay. That's exactly what we wanted. Yeah, this is a pretty effective... Uh, should I? No, I don't want to use my alter yet. I can still use the rarify option. Now, last time I did this ru this weapon, once I got some effective uh, builds, I had um, or effective boons, I was basically able to clear just base enemies extremely quickly. But now we're going to be looking at something on the the special. I'm not sure what. Maybe Demeter? Queen Hera, this message. Cast and flick Hitch. Whenever you're on a magic, prime until next location to restore all. Whenever Hitch flick foes are slain. Uh, yeah. Granted. The sacred bond. It's tempting. I'm going to go with Her uh, Hermes. Oh, just straight up killed that guy. I should have done hitch on the special. Oh well. Nothing we can do about it now. truth to that. Each time you slay a foe, deal more damage in the next 30 seconds. A mega cast costs less. Your sprint is 15. Yeah, we'll just go with the faster sprint. Uh, inflict weak on nearby foes and gradually restore magic while any nearby foe is weak. Your attacks gain power, but you prime 20. Deal more damage while you have at least... I'm not going to be using a ton of magic, so we'll go with that. Priming is actually not going to be a huge detriment. Spinning, spinning goes the thread. My customer. 
Should I have held back when I was challenged by the gods themselves to decide who was the greatest weaver of all? I was just a mortal girl. Can you imagine the pressure? I wouldn't have held back either in your place. When our limits are <coughs> to the test, only then can we discover who we really are. All I discovered was I ceased being a mortal girl anymore. You should have seen the masterpiece I made. Athena's little tapestry wasn't even close. Maybe it was worth it. My humiliation in exchange for hers. Hmm. Probably want to do faster channel. Magic. Don't need to. Don't need to use the storage yet. to get something good on the special to really get our damage ra uh, ramped up. Artemis, give me something good. It's strange, isn't it? He's our own grandfather. Blue Kronos, I mean. <clears throat> but I feel no connection to him at all. I just want him gone. Doesn't matter who he is. He's a threat. We're the Silver Sisters. We'll make him gone. For the sake of the realms. Strictly business, then, is it? Even still, funny how it falls on us to settle the older generation scores. Uh... After you dash, your Omega moves deal more damage for two seconds. But I'm not gonna. I don't know. I think we'll just go with just extra critical hit chance, even though it's not a huge amount. See you. Pomegranate. All right. I think we need more health. Take that. I actually don't remember what these are for, even when I still need them. Alright, shop. I need a boon for the special. Which one? Let's get to work. Expecting someone else? 
Or just as likely not expecting anybody in particular. Because a blessing is a blessing, ain't that right? Yeah, uh, probably do it on the cast, honestly. Yeah. She just jumps away. Actually, it's pretty funny. How fares the goddess of the hunt? By now, these woods must feel a second home to her. Sister Artemis appears quite well, so much as possible of late. If anything, she seems in better spirits than before. Good. She, Selene, you and I have all prepared for this contingency, and now tis time we shine. Particularly you and I right now. Okay, so yeah, Artemis, Selene, Melanoe, and Hecate are the Silver Sisters. I kind of figured that's what they meant, but I wasn't sure if they'd actually establish that at some point. This cast is actually pretty strong. Kind of un underestimated it. Okay, I gotta dodge this. Okay, uh, I feel maybe Demeter? Yeah, let's go this Demeter. One. Uh, sure. Down I go. Probably should be saving most of my cash, though. Give me something good. Darkness. We got plasma. I think I still need one more though, unfortunately. Oh wait a second. Got some gold. Three boons you find are limited to common blessings afterwards your specials deal plus them. I think that's pretty good. We got the Demeter keepsake, so if Demeter shows up, I can use that to rarefy it. Thank <laughs> you. 
There we go, there's Demeter. Give me that special. What are you doing in those brackish depths, flower? Even Poseidon has turned his back on what lurks in that corner of the sea. Does such a path truly lead deeper into hell? Uh, damn it. Okay. Do I not have the reroll option? Oh, I think I turned it off for boons. Damn it. I'm gonna save save the rarefy option in case Demeter shows up again. I guess. Use one of our. Sure, whatever. Is that the attack? Yep. Looks valuable, Rocky. All right, I'm gonna unseal this one just to see what I get. If it's Demeter, I'll take it. If not, I'll take the hammer. Yep, take the hammer. should have gone to the shop, honestly. What is she wearing? Skilla, I've noticed your song, I Am Gonna Claw, may be inspired by true events. Is trying to drown me not sufficiently entertaining that I must also be the subject of your ridicule? Oh, how can you be so egotistical even? <laughs> I have that song worked out since way before you showed up. Any and all similarity is entirely coincidence. Uh, yeah. Classic legal defense. It's like, oh, it's, you know, all similarities to real persons, to, to persons real or imagined is purely fictional. Come on, insulting my hair and attire, making <clears> claims <throat> that I'm obsessed with you. But if I'm not the subject of the song, who was, pray tell? No need to get personal, lady. If I go sharing every detail of my private life with every deranged fan who burges in here, then it wouldn't be a private life, would it? 
Still stinging. Very easy fight that time. Alright, now the question is do I keep the Demeter keepsake? I just did not get very lucky with Demeter showing up when I wanted her to. Uh, sure. Hmm. Don't have enough for the black and fleece. That's the downside of that um, that one arcana card. It's like since it reduces the damage you take, it actually makes black and fleece harder to activate. Crystal figure seems like it'd be good too in this situation, but time to dry off. Really want that that Demeter special. That's gonna be amazing once I. Get this chaos boon ready too. Yeah, there's Demeter. Much smaller arena. guys come from they were here earlier All right, come on there we go there's a special yes of course that was all of them well we want the hammer this time sorry Demeter we only need the special that's it Something good, something good. Tax linger for plus two seconds launch. Uh, make a special creates for plus one flare. Your specials grow in size. Deal up to... Yes! Combine that with... Alright, Echo. How goes it, Echo? I'm doing alright. I'm doing alright. Doing alright. 
so many dangers all throughout these fields. Yet you're on this bridge. I feel a sense of comfort, even peace. It's because of your presence and your power. I gotta say, I also kind of like that little thing that Melanoa actually says, like, I'm doing all right to kind of prompt Echo to use that. Like, since she can only repeat word phrases. It's actually, I don't know, it's just very nice, like, the writing. It kind of shows that she's, like, very much, like, in tune of Echo and her situation. I like it. So probably the attack, that'd be good. Oh, we can get another hammer. Hell yeah. Come on! Let me let me be friends with the dog. I'm gonna have to do another underworld run just to recruit the dog. Now that I know where it is, that definitely helps a lot. I'm not your prey, Smackers. Stupid. Well, you have at least two of each. Plus twenty. Okay, so we just need one air. Off I go. That's the chaos boon finally cleared. Collect reward. God. <laughs> Take that. I see you too, statue. Statue? Oh, that? Huh. I have to go now. Alright. We got something over here. Handle ring. air. Well, I have at least three earth. All your common boons gain rarity. I mean, could definitely take that. Strength of earth. And sure, might as well pop off on our health. Server should be pretty easy, to be honest. damage to him. Got him! 
That was easy, honestly. The grim, resourceful underworld princess somehow soothes the savage beast. Very nice. And there's the nightmare. The will of night is done. We seem to have a pretty strong build here. Still need a air element if we're going to get that infusion up and running. So, kind of have to get lucky here, I guess. What should we take? Uh, experimental ha hammer. Your attacks knock foes away and have plus ten power. That sounds pretty good. Going down. Should have checked the well of Caron, honestly. Oh well. Maintenance access. They'll know I'm here. Okay. She is heading for the house again. Stop her. We got a pretty strong build here. I'm feeling pretty confident, actually. Why, thank you. Everybody. Oh, there he is. And so once I actually hit someone, they just melt. It's too bad these guys just teleport all over the place. All right, Hades. Give me something good. Greetings, Father. The monstrous Hound of Hell bears countless fangs, as if to say, "Back off." I'd rather keep my hand. Oh. I just want to pet the dog. Who else besides Prometheus does Kronos have under his thumb? I would know every last Titan or such ilk who deigned to turn on us. Besides marauding hordes of satyrs and such, the ones that come to mind include the Cyclops Polyphemus and Nyx's daughter, Eris, though she may be acting on her own. Strife could never be controlled. Nyx knew only too well. As for that Cyclops, he and your uncle Poseidon have some history that may have spurred his impulses. Well, it is not yet the longest list of enemies, at least. <laughs> Uh, take damage, go dark for 10 seconds, recharges in 40 seconds, restore health for 1%. Uh, let's go damage while dark. Now, leave me be. Thank you, Father. Options. Hephaestus? Yeah, let's see what Hephaestus has to offer. Oh, 
need him. Still need that air. Not gonna get that, it doesn't look like. Um Pretty good. Actually gonna take the special this time. All right. Good job. Yeah, I haven't gotten Selene yet. No, no reason to get it now. I don't think. This weapon is just kind of ridiculous, just throwing attacks just all over the freaking place. I kind of love it. Even though the screen's just a total mess of just nonsense you can't even see. damage. Don't get one here, unfortunately. Greetings, my dear. As much as your father was custodian of all the dead, so are we responsible for the rest of the world. The hour has grown dark, yes, but we have the power to restore. Thanks be to my good sister Demeter. Ooh, do a boon. The time for restoration always comes, as does the spring. But we're amidst a long winter, without an end in sight. We need concern ourselves with naught else, O oh Queen. Your keepsakes are stronger this night. And I think that's the only thing that... Well, unfortunately, I can't really use my keepsake. This one, please. Uh Yes. I thought that count I thought um Yeah, I thought that counted as like one of each um element, but I guess not. I guess it's its own separate element. Damn. So I I don't get that 20% extra damage. That's a shame. Probably should have taken the Zeus keepsake, honestly. <laughs> Foresight confessed that you were able to withstand his fury, to which I said, Prometheus, my good fellow, if you knew this would transpire, why did you not forewarn me? And why did you not prevent it? 
Perhaps you overestimate the Titan of Foresight's power to clearly see into the future, along with his strength. He claims to keep the details of the future to himself, so as not to alter the desired outcome. How convenient. It does not take a genius such as he to know I shall eventually prevail. Dealing a lot of damage to him. <laughs> Not like big chunks of damage, but we're kind of whittling him down fairly quickly. Alright, phase one done. Pretty well. More of this Prophecy damage. fulfilled. Should be the one for the Arcana cards. I double check so I can actually get it this time. Fine princess of the underworld. The time shall come when all shall be made clear. Return to shadow now. Should be getting all those, uh... Just need to keep that up. Prophecy, what do I get? What do I get? Can the agent five nightmare. Nice. That was three for the three face. Almost done on this one too. Just gotta get that slicer one. Just still doing the fangs until I get that one done. Fresh from the pot. All right. Good show that time. All those olives I need. Got those. Olives. Uh, ooh, got some with. Let's plant these. Got something with hypnos. Let's see what we got there. Last time he was trying to he was trying to tell us to try something. Garlic, wheat, city of Farah. Plenty of room to grow. Not hypnos. When I was in Tartarus, I found some seeds which grew into poppies. 
like the ones that line your bedding there. What if I use them with... I just had an idea. I promise to be careful. End to deep slumber. Ooh, what is this? A means to wake Lord Hypnos, possibly. I mean, hell yeah, we gotta do that. Grants one dream vapors. Sleep is not death, or the sleeping awake. So mote it be. Spreading of ashes. So let's go ahead and get that. <clears throat> Alright. Should, before I talk to Hypnos, I'm going to make sure I get everything else. What that nightmare. Yeah, I spent a bunch of my bones, and so now I'm like almost out. Anything of use out there in your forays? No point returning empty handed. Though you may lack the necessary tools, I suppose. Erebus still teems with hidden life. I'm finding all sorts of things we need out there. I'm very grateful for the purse, it never weighs me down. A witch cannot afford to be encumbered. The blessings and such from your relatives may be fleeting, but whatever goes into that purse isn't going anywhere. Not till you use it, of course. Like, they actually acknowledge, like, where you keep all this stuff? Oh, Dora, where are you? Dora? Wow. What brings you all the way out here? The Taverna is just about the last place I expected to find you. Um, way to make me feel incredibly self-conscious. Thanks, Mel. But, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to put myself out there a bit more, I guess. Now that you've saddled me with my big, important task. Well, I think that's great. <laughs> Though, I know how difficult it is. I used to never be able to approach others, but I kept doing it, and it's easier now. Easier, but never easy, right? I don't know why I bother. Most of these jades are pretty boring. They haven't met you yet. So we're up to fishing with Dora. Well, well. Nemesis, we got the Ambrosia. Ought to admit it when I'm wrong. Never thought you'd get to Kronos in the first place, before I did anyway. Much less beat him down repeatedly. So, but, what? I was wrong. Sorry. But Nemesis was apologizing? What the hell? Nemesis, I want you to know it was astonishing to hear those words coming from you just now. It seems we're each more than capable of surprising the other. But mainly, thank you. Wow. No need. Fair is fair. Had my chances to catch up with you, but couldn't get through all the pitfalls in the way. Might be I could have taken Kronos too, but now I'm not so sure. Now don't lose heart. There's much left to be done, and we need all your strength and vigilance. We're the unseen. Together we prevail, or we fail. Couldn't resist giving one of your pep talks, huh? <laughs> No. Well, let bygones hey, be bygones. I know there's an extraordinary likelihood you're going to say no, but I've an extra special poison bottle here, and thought maybe we could split it at the taverna, you and I. So damn polite. Well, it's less excessive if we split the bottle, I guess. Ugh, you know what? Whatever. Sure. It's like we're actually being Save. friends with Nemesis? Got your ass kicked by me. I think that was when I first thought I had a chance that Hecate would pick me if I could take you just like that a few more times. You're a monster, Nem. I practically started to fear having to spar with you. But the best way to get stronger is to train against a stronger opponent. Maybe that's why I've been stagnating. We don't get to fight like we used to. Makes me sick even thinking about it. Wait, you stand around thinking about how we used to spar? Should I be flattered or afraid? Ooh. Finish your half of the damn poison already. Don't have all night to sit around and stroke your ego. I swear, mortals take after our worst qualities. I wasn't being serious. Though, maybe I'm more self-centered than I realize. I am part mortal on my mother's side. Makes you different, I will give you that. 
Now come on, I gotta get back. Else Hecate might catch us making nice and then neither one of us will hear the end of it. Kinda of surprising. Like Mel and Nemesis actually getting along. Nice change of price from the poison starting to kick in. You better get your ass out of here before I keel over. Yeah. It's actually kind of surprising. It's kind of a nice change from Nemesis basically just being, for lack of a better term, a bitch. It'll be our secret. We got all this. I'm gonna have to get some more seeds now. I only got all these two garlic cloves. All right. I was just thinking of your travels, taking you beneath the surface and above, I reckon, to the ends of the earth. Tell me a journey. Got to be a better word for it. An odyssey? Thought his task not sufficiently extravagant. Perhaps a segment? <clears throat> or a voyage? Quest doesn't feel right at all. No, too upbeat. And voyage is more of a nautical term. We'll think of something. Trek. Sojourn. Sojourn. <laughs> All right. Um, who else right talk to? Maros and Eris don't seem like they're here. All right. So let's see what we got with Hypnos. What is this all about? Dream vapors, mostly used for attempting to rouse Hypnos, brewed in the cauldron. Please work. Lord Hypnos, you have slumbered long enough. I know you're lost in dream, but I shall do my best to lead you back here to reality. Now breathe in deep. Whoa. What is this? Is this? <gasps> Where am I? It's the House of Hades. Oh, there's these little cardboard cutouts ref referencing the, the shades. That's hilarious. Oh, there's... Still fast asleep. Even here. Oh, there's there's Thanatos. <laughs> Is the red one supposed to be Zagreus? No, nah, probably not. It's probably just a random red one. Oh, there's Sadius. <laughs> oh my god. That is too funny. Welcome to the hell. He said how? He's trying to communicate. Lord Hypnos. I'm Malinui, daughter of Hades, and I mean to find a way to rouse you from your slumber. Can you hear me? Awake. I'm awake. I... <laughs> <laughs> How is it that you sleep even in dream? What can I do to bring you back to us? Because we need you. Your own sister tells me that your wisdom and knowledge are second to none. We walked straight into. I walked straight into what? Lord Hypnos, I don't understand. You have to snap out of this. My time here runs short, and if this doesn't work, I don't know what else to do. Dream come true. Thanks for stopping by. That was interesting. Not at all as I was expecting. Hmm. No, his consciousness, it slipped away from me. How am I... Oh, I need to think. Can I brew more of those things? Pleasant dreams for now. Some garlic. Oh, cauldron. It was just the one? At some point, there's got to be a way to brew more of those. So that was definitely interesting. There's got to be something else there. How about... It's on the staff now. Right again. Well... Well, I'll have to call it there for now. Well, actually, let's talk to Skelly first, see what he has to say. Say, young one, 
I'd ask of you a question that pertains to good Lord Charon, if you please. Seems like you understand him pretty good. Has he, uh, said anything of late regarding me? Commander, I... I'm sorry, no. But I'll be certain to put in a good word. You've been indispensable, and Lord Charon ought to be aware. No! I mean, um... <laughs> just don't go doing anything like that. You need not burden more the boatmen with such trivialities amid such turbulent times. Don't bother him, okay? <laughs> what are you hiding, Skelly? Um, okay. I mean... If you know... We won't press for now. Damn, we need one more plasma. And then for the other weapons... Yeah, I got them all unlocked. Even if it's just rank one. I'm going to start trying the other ones. So far, I've only been trying one of each weapon. Not impressed. The oath. This is um, Polyphemus now. On both the, the blades and the staff. But mainly, I want to do another underworld run just to get another chance at the plasma in the Chaos Realm. But anyway, we'll have to call it there for now. Very interesting seeing a little bit of progress on Hypnosis' little storyline there. And we completed another... Um, <clears throat> excuse me, we completed another uh, prophecy. So we got some more of the Nightmare. And I got a couple more coming on that little time gate thing. So definitely making progress. Feeling pretty good about you know how we're doing in the game right now. Um... Mostly just kind of want to keep upgrading the different weapons, getting the different aspects. Might might try Momus, see how that does. Whenever you use Omega moves, each fires in place up to three times until you use it again. Delay between Omega bursts three seconds. Become even stronger. Oh, damn it, that was that was to upgrade. I just wanted to switch to it. Okay, and that's pretty interesting. Yeah, the delay is definitely kind of kind of makes it not super useful. Maybe we'll stick. I might. That might be another aspect. I might stick with the default, or stick with a different aspect until I upgrade it. Kind of like I said with the um, the axe aspect of Thantos. I think will be really powerful once it's fully unlocked. Which is actually not too bad now, to be honest. On my last run, I did pretty well with it. But, um, like, the base level of the aspect of Thanatos is just kind of a weaker version of the of the base axe. So, it's like, why would you really use it? Because you kind of miss out on the, you know, other benefits. But, whatever. Like I said, probably what we'll be doing in the future is, one, going to be trying to do another Underworld run to try and get that plasma I need to unlock the final aspect of the black coat. Um, but yeah, probably we've tried uh, one of the aspects of each of the weapons at least once, and we're going to probably try to start doing some of the other ones, uh, doing a little bit more experimentation. I did try the aspect of Charon a little bit on the axe, just did like a little trial run with it on the, the black stone there. But really want to do the, the Black Coat. Like, that's kind of my favorite weapon right now. So I really want to try both aspects. Because the aspect of Selene's okay. Not my favorite. I'd rather just do the um, the base aspect. Not the that one. But we'll try the other one when we get the chance. And in the meantime, we'll try the different aspects of the other weapons as well. Um, really looking forward to trying the, the aspect of Artemis on the blades. That one sounds like it'll be really good. Maybe the other aspect on the torches. Uh, for the staff, I don't know. I don't know if I necessarily want to invest the nightmare into it right now to get that Momo's aspect um, good. Right now it just kind of feels like it's not going to be that good until you invest the time into it. Like, if you can get that delay down, I feel like it could be really strong. But until then, you know, that's, that's going to have to come uh, at a later date. So, like I said, for now... Thank you very much for watching. I'll be back again soon with more. Hope to see you then. Bye.